another 4.95 million barrels. Okay, so we're uh, we're up 5.9 million barrels of oil. Um, uh, just so you know, we have a ton of oil, and we don't know what to do with it. So get in your car and go drive somewhere. <laughs> That's what you should do. D screw the c lockdown. D just I walked into Walmart, and I gave a big hug to this lady I know at... Uh, uh, you know, the only way you're going to get through this is herd, human, uh, herd immunity, okay? That means just naturally uh, interacting with human beings. Uh, hi, this is Brian Young with ProTinkerToys.com, ProTinkerToys.com, shipping with Brian. And we're only going to do a one-hour episode today. Um, and um, we're going to try to finalize exactly how we're going to continue doing this. I do have an update, a major update, uh, probably the most important update... Uh, um, that is that I went to McDonald's last night and I ordered a double hamburger. Now, if anybody knows me, okay, I like to order food and get it the way I like it, you know? So, you know, and then my brother complains to me, why are you so picky? Well, you know, if I'm buying a burger, I want it the way I like it, you know? And so I ordered a double hamburger with mustard and ketchup only and shredded lettuce. That's how I like it. You know, that's America. Now, if I was in communist China, they'd just tell me, hey, you get what you get. If you don't like it, we'll shoot you. So anyway, I check out and um, you didn't have lettuce. And well, I can't give it back to them because of the virus thing. So I got double hamburger. So they went and made, pulled up. Lady comes out. She gave me a double cheeseburger. <laughs> <laughs> I got a double cheeseburger. I go, no, no, no. I want a double hamburger with lettuce, mustard, and ketchup only. Okay. And uh, so then they came back with my hair. So I got basically a double hamburger and a double cheeseburger free. Okay. And then they gave me a nice coupon for dessert. Uh, now, why do I say that? Why do you even talk about that? Well, I don't know. Because... See, McDonald's has lost their way. And just like a lot of retailers have lost their way. Matter of fact, you know, like J.C. Penney's. I can fix J.C. Penney's problems and make them probably number two in the nation in about a year. Give me, give me one year unlimited access to J.C. Penney's and I can fix their problem. I know exactly what their problem is. I'm not going to tell you, but I know exactly what their problem is. Okay, so anyways, this is Brian Young in the shed. Uh, it's uh, shipping with Brian was shipping. Uh, and uh, so I'm going to start shipping and pulling items. Uh, I just called my freight company, Estes Freight. The snake mongoose sets have arrived into Toledo and they'll be calling me shortly today for scheduling pickup tomorrow. So that means these will be delivered tomorrow between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. And we are going to be live as all that time. As soon as I, I'm in fact, I'm going to be live when I get a call, and we're going to be tracking it with the freight. Now I don't know how many people are alive with me today. Let's see what we're how we're doing today because I don't know if anybody's listening. We've got five people uh, are watching. Okay, so I sold another dart. These things are these things are selling like crazy. I just bought a semi of these. I must have sold five of these in the last uh, three or four days. These are funny cars, too. I just sold a 1,200 pack of uh, building block Lego type things. I listed our digital uh, Art Pro uh, Skelectric Digital Kit, uh, the bundle package. I've got it at a great price, $399. I wanted to give, I wanted to make a little bit of money, but not a lot. I feel like, you know, if I could sell these at $399, I won't make as much as I'd like to make, but it's enough to that I could keep on selling them at that price. So if you see this at $3.99, it's a good deal. Okay? All right. Uh, all right. So I've got to get... All right. I made up a new little sheet here. I'll show you what I do here. So um, I made up... They're called a pole sheet. Every morning, I fill out these pull sheets of the things I need to pull 
uh, get ready to ship. All right, so I'm going to go, uh, well, I'm going to talk while I walk around the shed. Good morning, Antoine, or Adam, ordered my mongoose set. Yes, Adam Hurt ordered his mongoose set. <laughs> I do thank you very much for buying that. You didn't need to buy that. And Adam's got his ma snake mongoose sets on order, and those will be coming in tomorrow, Adam. And you're, you're going to actually see us pack your ad set, and you'll actually see it go on the, on the UPS truck. Can you believe that? Isn't that amazing how technology is? So, all right, so I'm going to walk around here and pick some items that I need to take. All right, so I think this is what we're going to do. So it's 60980, and that is six, now, Arrows F1 GP Monaco, not 2002. It's an F1 car by Scale Electric or by SCX. Now, I need a Nissan. I need two Nissan um, Tyco Nissans. These are really popular cars, Tyco. Tyco Nissan. I've had a lot of sh delay in shipping, which is really upsetting me, but there's nothing I can do about it. It is the it is the it is the problem of the postal service. They're overwhelmed and they can't get items to people. All right. All right. So I did. Um, I've got two Nissans Tyco Tyco 440X2s. Okay. So I got that. Now we're going to move on to. I need an off-road car, Tyco off-road. So I'm coming back here to our our uh, <clears throat> shelving unit. Okay, I've got the Tyco Turbo Turbo Hoppers, Turbo Hoppo Hopper, Turbo Hopper, Turbo tur Turbo Hopper. It's a Turbo Hopper. I'll show you what they are. They're really nice cars. Matter of fact, uh, you drag put that one on your uh, track, uh, uh, Adam. That's a turbo hopper. That's got 440X2. That thing would just go beam like that. <laughs> All right. So that's this item. I got my hand throttles right here. Okay. Now a golf. Okay. So a head to head, head to head set. All right. Hold on a second. I need to go upstairs and get a couple women. Oh, I didn't write those things down. See, I made this list because I'm getting old. And I forget things, okay, and so I have to write them down. All right, so he ordered three hand throttles. I've got that. $29, okay, uh, 19. Kevin Combs, he ordered a die-cast black pistol single holster, 5504. He ordered one of those. I'm going to send him a sample of caps. All right, so we're going to get that, and then we got uh, a Lego kit. Lego kit, yeah, I, I listed all my Legos on ProTinkerToys.com, so if you like Legos, check out my collection. I put everyone on sale. All right, that's a retired set. Chimba, uh, one of those, one of those. Okay, so that's going out today. Um, let's see, and, uh, okay, Adam. Oh, yeah, okay, all right, Jessica Lewinsky, okay, that, yep, that, that gents, Jessica, okay, so she ordered the Lego, 1950, what's Jacob, oh, that was for the hand throttle, okay, so that's that, hand throttle, got that, and then R Renise Collins, what did she order, oh, she ordered the uh, Legos, yeah, the building block, 1200 count, that was a good deal, okay, so we've got that, we've got that, we got that, and then we've got Brianna. Brianna, what's Brianna? Brianna, what's Brianna ordered? Brianna, Brianna ordered a snake mongoose set in Orville, Ohio. Bri, 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 Brianna, Brianna, where's the last name? Brianna, who's Brianna? Who in the heck is Brianna? Uh, I thought uh, Adam Hurt o ordered that. Uh, I'll have to, I'll have to research that. To see what the heck's going on here. Okay, so let me go get those two things upstairs. So you can, uh, I I've got my new microphone, so you should be able to hear me as I go upstairs. So I'm, I'm going upstairs to the workshop now. If you're, if you live in, um, if you live in the United States of America and you want to visit ProTinkerToys.com. Or you just want to visit me? Well, I live in Wayne, Ohio. Okay, so 
to do is get in your car and drive here. That's about as easy as I can tell you. Okay? All right. Now, I got to find this gun. Oh, brother. You know, I think I'm out of this one. You know what's funny is I'm always out of the last one that I need. Oh, brother. I don't have a great system yet because, see, I, I started this. You know, a lot of people think, well, how did you start this, Brian? Well, you know what? I started this kind of on the... Um, uh, I'm just, I just was having fun, and I, I started selling stuff on eBay, and then it got bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger, and then I realized that uh, people, pe more people were buying, and so then I ordered more and more, you know, and then I, so then I've had all this stuff, a lot of this stuff I've had for months, some of these guns I've had for a year almost. And I hadn't sold a single one, which was really kind of depressing me. And then, I got it right here. Okay, so is that it? 5504. 5502. You've got to be kidding. Unbelievable. Oh, come on. A lawman, that's a lawman. Five five oh two. When you know it. Five five oh two. Oh my goodness gracious. I think that's it right there. The kids have been in my guns. Oh I'm gonna Billy Yang. <laughs> I tell you it never fails. It never fails. I always am missing one stupid gun. I mean, this this really kind of is gets me really kind of like, what the heck? All right, those are. Uh, all right, nope. Those are Texas Rose. Billy the Kid, Texas Rose. For the love of Mike. I can't believe this. <sighs> Shoot. That figures. You know, that just figures. I, I, I'm always... Now i got to order that gun. <sighs> and I just got an order in. You know, I hate doing just an, a single order. Um, <sighs> I hate doing just a single order. And now I'm just talking. I don't know if anybody's listening. All right, I'm upstairs, so... If everybody is catching what I'm saying, just send me a voice saying, yeah, Brian, we can hear you. And just say, we're sorry that you screwed up. Just say, we're sorry you screwed up. Okay, I'm sorry I screwed up. All right, now which one is that? King. Well, now I can't find the Lego kit that I wanted to find. Oh, my gosh. You know, I think I'm really losing my mind. I, I really do. It's a flying bird. But it's not that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. If I don't have this kit, I'm really going to start getting upset. Oh my gosh. What the heck happened? Oh my gosh, I'm about ready to lose it. I'm about ready to lose it. 70146. That's not it. I thought I had a half a dozen of these. Two two seven, two two seven, two two seven. You know what? Now I'm 
now I'm officially upset today. Because I have to cancel another order. I, I'm really getting frustrated. Oh my goodness. You know what my problem is? Can I tell you what my problem is? I have too much stuff. I don't understand it. I, I swear I thought I had that kit. But I've got the wrong one. I've got all of these King Chromorus rescues. One, two, three, four, five, six of them. I got six of them. Oh my goodness gracious, Brian. Well, I, I don't know what to do. That means I gotta cancel that order. <laughs> I tell you, people. Uh, oh, my mind is going crazy. <laughs> oh dear. Not here. I, I don't have it. I don't have it. Unbelievable. I don't have it. I don't have 70146. It's inventoried. Okay, so I just went upstairs. Mike is good, Brian, okay. I just went upstairs, and my inventory of these kits is just... It has vanished. I And I don't understand... How many set? How many okay, the flying? How many of this thing I have? One available. Okay, so I have one. <laughs> of course, I don't have the one. <laughs> oh, for the love of Mike! <laughs> of course, I don't have the one. Of course, I don't have the one. I mean, that's just that's naturally the case, you know. See. And another problem is, you know, I, I am semi-retired. You know, it's not like this is my full-time job, which it is. I do this because I want to have fun. <laughs> and I'm not having fun right now because I can't find this one item. I, I, I think I'm going to... You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to have... I'm going to have one of my happy pills. And you're asking me, what is a happy pill? Well, I'm going to show you. Okay, so I'm going to come over here. Now, I normally have my other happy pills, but I found these on uh, Amazon. And uh, <laughs> you'll probably say, well, Brian, you shouldn't have that to begin with. You're kind of, you kind of got of a stomach. Well, you know what? I'm 50, I'm 60 years old. Okay, let me give you some uh definitions here. My sons always say, well, Brian, Dad, you could lose some weight. You know what? You're probably right. You know, but you know what? For about 40 years of my life, I was underweight. I was about 199 pounds to 200. When I got married, I had mono for 30 days and I got, I dropped down to 155 pounds, 140 actually. I am 60 years old. I've got 10 kids. I've been married 34 years. I don't care what people will think I look at look like so i love these these are <laughs> these make me happy <laughs> and i don't eat i don't eat a whole one a day you know i have i've got a whole I'm about 10, they last me about a couple weeks you know what i just like maybe one or two a day i take them because you can break them up in little cubes they're called milka with a little biscuit see the little biscuit so the biscuit and the chocolate, that makes me happy. Okay, so I'm happy now. So let me see if this gun is over here. I might have that gun over here. I think I might have one of them. I found one. I found one. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, thank you so much. This got right here. 
die cast. Paris Manufacturing, best gun. You got a kid? All right, I'm going to go upstairs one more time and see if I can find this Lego kit. If I don't, I'm going to jump out the window. If you hear me falling, ah, like that, you know that I've gotten frustrated. No, I'm just kidding. All right, Darren Cooper. Hey, Darren Cooper's down in Australia. Hey, I talked about you, Darren, on Sunday about how I could be on my computer right here, live broadcast, and talk to Darren from Australia, down under. Good morning, Don Ellis. All right, guys. I'm going back upstairs. I'm going upstairs. I got to find this Lego kit that it says I have one. Now, that might be a lie because my kids have been taking these kits. And I think they did. I think it's right here. No, that's the elephant. Not it. Not it. Not it. That's not it. All right. One, two, three, four, five. I got five of these stupid. Oh, for the love of Mike. You know what it is, guys? Oh, and you know what I forgot to tell you guys? You want to have something fun? I'm going to bring down a couple things that I've got up here that I'm going to show you that you really just need to have buy to have fun. I, I yeah I, I I sell things because that's what I do. I sell things. I am a retailer, and if I'm not a good salesman, if I can't sell you something that you really don't need, well, the fact of the matter is, we always need something. <laughs> <laughs> we always need something. Listen, I don't need half this stuff that's in my workshop, but you know what? I do. Okay, so I don't have that mod Lego kit, and I'm really upset now. So I need another happy pill. No, I don't need one right now. One is enough for right now. Now my son will get on and say, Dad, you need to quit eating that chocolate. You're going to get fat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, guys, so here's what it is. Firefox, we got these things online right here. Firefox, let's see here. Um, let me go to products. I think they better be online. If they're not online, I'm going to have a highly canily, canorky, snorky doki. FXX963-2628. Okay, Firefox Airliner. Okay, now this... Okay, this is really cool. All right, so I'm going to show you how this thing works. So this thing is really cool. For the amount of money that this thing, what is this I have online? I mean, 24 bucks. Come on, you spend $24 at, at going to McDonald's. Okay, it comes with decals. It comes with engines, a tail fin. So you stick the wing in like you normally would. And this is a high impact uh, uh, high impact styrofoam. And it's got jet engines. Check this out. So the jet engines go in here. Oh, hey. Yeah, I'm just listening now. The limits on meat. Hey, go to your local butcher. Already they're starting to get lines there, too. Check this out, guys. Look at this. Now, with the decals on, with the decals on, it looks like this. 
Check this out. Watch this. Isn't that cool? Ooh! Outside, it's a lot awesome. A lot more awesome. Ooh, wow, that's good. Oh, look at that. Oh, you'd have a fun day with that. That's the Firefox airline. Watch this. Here we go. We're going to fly right through the camera. All right, so anyway. So that's the Firefox airline. Firefox airliner. Hand launch glider. And uh, it comes with stickers. Look at these. All the stickers just to uh, decal it up. And then we also have the Firefox S series. You got the storm, the tornado, the hurricane, and the twist. These are really awesome. And then for just they're like, this is like 12 bucks. I have the blaze. This is the blaze right here. See, here I go again, getting off track. <laughs> yeah, this is fun. Oh, I already did this one. No, I already came like this. So the blaze has a tail fin like this. You pull the tape off a little bit. The double-sided tape. Ooh. These are just, they're great outside. I mean, these things are awesome outside. Okay, here we go. Ooh. Oh, tail fin came off. That's good. You want that to pop off because then you can just stick it right back on again. That's important. Now, sometimes the double-sided tape gets worn out. You just have to, all you have to do is just put double-sided tape on it. But normally, it sticks pretty good. Okay, so that is the, uh, that's the blaze. I got a great price on these. I bought them on a closeout. He wanted to move them. Somebody always wants to move something. All right, so that's it with that. All right, so I don't have that Lego kit. Damn, that makes me mad. What happens to all that stuff? Oh, shoot. I got to let that lady know I don't have that. Oh, dear. It's frustrating. I thought I had like six of those. I must have sold a bunch of those not knowing it. That's really weird. Okay, Don wanted to know about the, um, the uh, Snake Mongoose set. And the Snake Mongoose sets uh, arrived in Toledo yet, uh, this morning. And they'll be delivering to me tomorrow. I'll be getting uh, a call later today from the freight company scheduling a time. Normally, my time is usually from uh, 9 to 2 o'clock. And we'll be going, once I get, once I know that they're on the road, then we're going to go live from that moment. I'm going to uh, start a live broadcast tomorrow saying, hey, the freight truck is on its way. It's probably in Bowling Green or Toledo. And uh, we'll go from there. I gotta send this company. I gotta write this lady. Uh, why does that do that? All right, now let me do some shipping. 
Okay, so uh, Adam, uh, Adam, uh, I just wanted to clear up things. Brianna is my wife. I ordered it. To, okay, <laughs> I know that. I know, Adam. I was just kidding, but you didn't have a last name on that. It just says Brianna. So uh, I hope the um, UPS knows to deliver it to you. So, but I'm sure they do. I'm sure they will. Okay, so now, um, what do we do here? Okay, so I got to go back here. Now, normally what I do is when I have multiple items to ship. Oh, also, I forgot to get, let's see, a BMR. No, a Mantra and a McLaren. Uh, uh, a McLaren. No, Mantra. And a Texaco. Texaco and a Mantra. Mantra. These are... Uh, these are Palazzi cars. I think they're from they're from Spain. And these are cars from the 60s, late 60s. Late 60s, early 70s. These are great cars for the price. If you want to have just a bang up car and, and without magnets and just race like it used to be. This is these are it right here, baby. These are it right here, baby. Okay, so that that guy ordered both of these cars. He ordered the Texaco and the Mantra. Okay, I got my gun already. I got that. I got this. What else? I got the... Okay, somebody ordered the converter tracks. Already I'm selling these converter tracks, guys. I knew this was going to happen. I said once I listed these things, these things are going to go viral. Okay? These converter tracks from Ninko... Because I have unlimited Ninko track. So... Whatever kind of layout you want, I've got it. So these are, he just ordered two converter tracks from Nink, uh, from Ninko to Scale Electric. So, for example, you can use Scale Electric converter track, which I just listed on ProTinkerToys.com. You can take this, connect it with this, and connect all your sets together. Isn't that awesome? Oh, that's so sweet. I, I just love that. Okay. Ah, shoot. I just hate that I don't have that other... Oh, man, I want to cry. Uh, oh, M. I forgot one item. M. O three one O two. Okay. All right, so that's done there. I got those two cars pulled. I got those two done pulled. I got, I don't have one chassis there. I got to give a guy a refund all a bit of that. Um, I sold another Back to the Future set. These things are selling like crazy. I only have a limited number of them, about 20. If you want to buy, I hate to keep telling you guys things to buy something, but you know what? I wouldn't be a good salesman if I didn't. If you want to get the McLaren or the Buff 1946 Ford, the only way to get it is in this set. And now I only have, let's see, nine. Nine and nine is what? Eighteen. I have eighteen left. Okay, so that one sold. I don't want to force you guys to buy something. You know your limitation. But I'll tell you one thing. I sure keep getting the good stuff. All right. Yeah, can you believe that woman in Texas got three, eight days in jail for trying to feed her family, being a hair salon? I tell you, this is not right in America. That judge should be prosecuted just like the Nuremberg trials. He, he should not obey the law. Sometimes laws are not just, and those are not constitutional. Unbelievable. I tell you, it just makes me... I, I just... Uh, Okay, so Adam just asked me if we're giving away cars. I, I hadn't been giving away cars lately, um, but I, I haven't really decided how I'm going to do that yet. You might end up getting a car in the mail anyway. So if you get one, you get one. If you don't, you won't. 
film it was a, I didn't really put a time frame on it, but I was kind of like just doing a stimulus deal back when the time was like, this was a month ago. Um, so if you get a car, you know, be thankful for it, I guess. Uh, if you don't, be understanding that, um, See here, can I just kind of, and I know you probably don't like me talking about this, but I want to give, I want to put things in perspective for people, okay? Because um, I've been in business for about 20 years. Uh, I've been, well, actually, no, I've been in retail since I got out of Navy for almost 40 years ago, 25, 35 years ago. A lot of people don't understand retail. Well, let me give you some facts that are going to disturb you. Number one, well, not facts, but I'm just going to give you details that you probably don't understand or probably are not being told about. So, so far, and these numbers you really have to kind of think about and understand the impact. Disney World shut nearly 50 days ago. So for basically from since the half of March, all of April, all of May, all of June, all of July, and maybe all of August, they are going to be closed. Now, you can't just look at Disney World and say, okay, well, they're closed, so what? Okay. No, you have to look at all the incidental businesses. Okay. Every business in Orlando that deals with Disney to stay in business, they're in business problems. They're in problem. They, they, they are going to go bankrupt. What I'm telling you is that unless people wake up to what is really going on, that we cannot uh, social distance the rest of our lives, that, you know, 50 to 70,000 die from the flu every year and we never deal, ever, never said anything about it. Now, all of a sudden, we're paranoid about, you know, the flu or something or something similar to the flu. It's destroying the economy. OK, you know, I. I don't know how, it, and that's not just Disney World. Uh, uh, here in Ohio, we have Sandusky, Ohio, which has Kalahari, Great Wolf Lodge, four other water parks, plus it has Cedar Point closed. Zero income. Hmm, how does that work? Zero income? Uh, no, that doesn't work. Okay, now you have airlines that have over 2,000 airplanes just sitting on the tarmac. See, I've been in supply and demand in the Navy. So I know that you have to constantly keep items maintenance. I was on submarines. Everything had to be in maintenance every month. There was a schedule. You had to do a maintenance. It was called SIM, Selective Item Management. And then I knew that these guys would come for O-rings and certain parts because they had to fix a valve every month. So you're keeping those airplanes on the tarmac for a month. Now, every one of those airplanes need to be serviced. So, you need to call your congressman, let them know that stop this shutdown or else it's going to get worse. Um, I, don't like to be, uh, I don't like to be a pessimist. I don't like to be a worrywart. But I look at things in a practical standpoint, which most people don't. Our politicians sure aren't. They're not. I call them every day about Sandusky. Nobody cares. Uh, that's, that's the least of our problems. Oh, really? Okay, so those 40,000 people... Are you crazy? I, I don't know, people. I, I don't know. I, I don't know if stupid has taken over, but I think stupid has taken over. All right. Stupid is as stupid does. You know, I, I, okay, so I'm over here. I'm going to get a car. All righty. I don't know. I, I don't know. And then, you know, so this barber hair salon has got served six days. This judge should have thrown that. 
See, here's the problem. And see, this is exactly what, and I hate to use this analogy, but this is exactly what, you know, we we, we, we got upset with all the, the, the Nazi uh, soldiers. You know, hey, we were just told to do our job. See, that's the old cliche. I was just to told to do what I was told. To well, you know, sooner or later, you have to say, you know what, enough's enough, and I'm not going to do it. Okay, so that's that. Uh, we got a half hour. What time is it? Five till ten after ten. We got another another half hour here. I'm now going to start packing. Okay, so I'm going to start packing. Okay, we got. Okay, I just got maybe another order. Maybe let me look to see here. No, that's not. Yeah, I think. Okay, I just got an order. Patrick Mofie. He just he just ordered ProTickerToys.com. ProTickerToys.com. He just got another order in. Patrick just placed an order with us. He just ordered the Legends of the Quarter Mile. This, I'll tell you, this is hot, hot, hot. I'm going to show you these. These cars are so hot. I am so glad I doubled my order. I was going to get one case of these cars, one case, and I decided, you know what? I'm going to go for it. And I went, I bought six cases of these. And these cars are beautiful, too. I'm going to show you all three of them. This is Sock and Martin, X-Traction, Legends in the Quarter Mile. I was telling Adam, these will go on your Snake Mongoose set. And, and you want it, you can actually do an oval for these cars. And then we got Dick Dick Landy and Bill Grumpy Jenkins in the, uh, that's the Chevrolet Camaro, the Plymouth Roadrunner, and the Dodge Challenger. I, yeah, these are sweet. I'm going to do this guy first. Ahem. Okay, so what I do normally is I got my shipping table here. I tape the bottom, obviously. And we'll put a card in there for ProTinkerToys.com. You know. And the Legends of the Quarter Mile. I, I am so glad I bought You know what? It's really good. It's really exciting to get something that people are really excited about. You know that? I've got so many fun things that are exciting about. Okay. So that is Legends of the Quarter Mile. What's the weight on that? Okay. Legends of the Quarter Mile, 8 ounces. All right. So what I do is normally after... I do them normally in group, but I'm just going to do this one real quick. Eight ounces. So I come over here. I go create shipping label. All right. Create shipping label. Create shipping label. Create shipping label. Okay. Let's see here. All right. Now let's see here. Hey, Professor Wacko. How you doing? Hey. Hey there. How you doing, everybody? Is everybody having fun today? Huh? Is everybody having fun? I know Brian's a nutcase. Anyways, hey, hey, Brian, how you doing? You having a good day? Good. Uh, shut up. Uh, you don't have to talk to me like that. Oh, I can talk to you any way I want to. Hey, well, Brian's getting everything ready to ship out next week. And I just want to stop in here and say, hello. See you later. Bye-bye. <laughs> I'll tell you, he's a crazy. He comes by here once in a while and just kind of disrupts my whole place here. Boy. <sighs> Tell you. All right. So uh, I got eight ounces. I got to change that to eight ounces. And no, I got to change the box or else that's going to change the weight. No, that's seven five by five. I got to change eight by eight by five. Eight by five by five. Eight ounces. Three dollars. Okay. So we're going to print that. All right. So Jeffrey Moffy. Moffy, we're shipping your order today. All right, so we just printed his label. All right, we just got that one all done. All right, so Jeffrey just ordered uh, three of the uh, Legends of the Quarter Mile. And those are ready to go. Now, we have all these orders right here. So what I do now, this is an international. This is international. This is U.S., this is international. This is U.S., U.S., U.S. Okay, so I have to... Um, 
I like to get all my small stuff done first because uh, it's easier. Just to be honest, that's the way it is. Let me take care of this other one. Here comes my boring son. David, what are you doing outside? Play outside. Okay, good. Keep on playing outside. TV. Why would you watch TV? I haven't watched it for the past four days. Four days? Yes. Well, you know what? Watching TV can destroy your mind. No. Yes. Uh -uh, I just want to see something. No. Television destroys your mind. Yeah, what is this? Mm. It destroys your mind. Right, David? There's something on the floor. Oh. Oh, shoot. God darn it. Get those out of there. Watch out. What is that in there? It's cards. You know, there is sometimes, see, you guys don't, you don't live here, but my life is sometimes completely chaos. I don't, I don't, regr I don't regret it, but uh, I'm just telling you, my life is chaos right now. I'm a 60-year-old with a uh, 7-year-old. Uh, I'm not complaining. I, I, I love that we save these kids from the absolute hell that they would be going through right now. Um, but it is stressful sometimes. I'll be honest. I'm just being honest with you. I rec, uh, you know, if you want to, there are over a thousand kids that need to be adopted. It's really sick what's going on. Okay, here we go. Hey, Don, I have sent you two emails, no response, requesting business cards, flyers, and trying to start SCS Club. Um, all right. Central New York. Okay. Request business cards, flyers, etc. Trying to start soccer. All right. I'll try to get you out those. Uh, I'm so busy, Don. Uh, Dan, Dan Ellis. Hey, give me a call later today, probably around three o'clock after I come back from the post office and we'll go over. We'll talk about that. Okay, Don. Okay. So that's three pounds. All right, Don, Dan, I mean, Dan Ellis, give me a call later today, okay? Okay, buddy. Okay, partner. Okay, partner. Yeah, partner. All right. Here he comes again. What? You need roll caps. Where did you get this anyway? Huh? I got that in the house. Yeah, I know, but where did you get it in the house? Huh? It was in mom's 
toy tub. Yeah, because you guys came out and get my kids come out here and steal all my guns. No, you gave me that a long, long time ago. I know, it's always a long, long time ago. Yeah, it, it was a long time ago. It was, huh? Yeah, it, it, you gave it to me. I have a feeling that you're not telling me the truth, David. I am. You gave it to me on my first day when I turned five. Oh, I did, huh? Do you remember that? Yeah. Give me a break. Eh. Is that supposed to be the right one, Dad? Yes, I know everything. <laughs> oh, I didn't know it was that one. It does shoot it. I want to shoot it. Hey, Dad, can I shoot it at that target right there? No, it doesn't shoot anything. It's a cap gun. Do you know what a cap gun is? Well, that's what I'm going to tell you. Oh. Hold on a second. This thing has been outside. Hold on, people. Now i got to oil this down. Wait, that been outside? It's amazing, guys, that I get distracted so quickly. David, this gun, it's been in outside laying around. It's got all rusty. There we go. Here. Do you want it or not? Come here. I'm not. Here. You have to pull the trigger. It's going to go snap. The snap gun. <sighs> I give up. Should I give up? Do you have a do you have contact with Auto World Skill Electric looking for support? Okay, I'll call later. Thanks. Yes. Well, I know people at all those different companies. But a lot of the companies they they don't have an interest um, for it with support in a sense. It's really um, Okay, now my. <laughs> okay, I just sold something else. Patrick Mo Montif. He just died. He just bought a. Sarah McNeil just bought a, a Desert Fox. That's another hot gun. That's the the uh, Desert Fox, the Rommel uh, Luger. I'm telling you, it's crazy right now. People are just buying my toy guns like crazy. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. 14 ounces. What do I do? 14 ounces. $18 international. It's going to Canada. Holy moly. Uh,
Hello. Uh, the set. Well, the sets won't be here until tomorrow. Well, I mean, uh, you can come now and and tomorrow, <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> Today and tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, yeah, see, now that is the stupidest comment. You can't eat, have your cake and eat it, too. Why can't I have my cake and eat it, too? If I buy a cake, I'm having my cake, and I want to eat it, too. Explain to me that phrase. I'm talking to Ryan on the phone, guys. He's the one that he talks to you a lot, okay? He just He's trying to skate out of something. I have no idea what he's trying to get out of now. It makes me so upset. Okay, you can't give me just one day, okay? That's just not going to work, all right? No, it's not. You're coming today and tomorrow when the snake mongoose sets are coming. You're you're already you're all you're already here. You might as well just come here for an hour. Maybe two. I don't care if you want to come tomorrow, but you better get here at nine o'clock so we can do get stuff a lot of stuff done be, before the sets come here because I'll need you here all day tomorrow. I I I have everything set up. I've had everything set up. Okay, so uh, you know, so you just need to keep your mouth uh, um, keep your mouth quiet. Before you get yourself in trouble, okay? Well, where are you right now? Okay, so you haven't even left yet. I'm always ready. I listed I listed that Arc Pro uh, combo set today. So you need to probably you probably put need to do some detail uh, data information in it if you want. Well, that's not okay. That is your main job. So I mean, anything happening with that? Well, okay, yeah, that's funny. Okay, so, so, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I tell you, I tell you, it's funny. Yeah, these boomers. Okay, well, you know what? Uh, you know, if you want to keep going down that road, I'll go down that road with you if you want. I've told you, I told you. Okay, so. Well, I'm not going to do it on the phone. Uh, let's see. Um, Adam Hurt, bribe him with free desert coupons. Ha, ha, ha. Bribe him with that free dessert. 
I'm already ready. I've been ready all day today for you. I've been ready for the last two hours. So my son, so if you, I've got basically, I have, uh, I have four baby boom or four millennials. My daughter, Kimberly, I think she was, she was just before the millennial. She was born in 90s, 86. I don't think she was a millennial. I think she was the generation before. We lost her in 2009. Anyways, my other millennials, they all have this view that, uh, you know, that we baby boomers are the problems. And, and to extent, to some extent, a lot of baby boomers are the problem, but these these uh, millennials are nutcases. I'm telling you, they're just they're crazy. They they live in this delusional world, you know, that everything is free. Okay, uh, nothing is free. I hate to tell people, you know, I always use. Okay, I'm getting off track again. Now it's already been an hour, and I haven't gotten anything done. Do you see what I'm doing here today? I haven't gotten a thing done, and I've already done an hour show. <laughs> All right, I'm printing these labels, and then I'm not gonna. I'm not. Gonna, when I print these labels, I'm not gonna talk to anybody until I'm done. Ready, set, print, print, print. Now I need my marker. I'm not gonna talk to anybody. I don't care if they call me. I don't care if they come fly right into my door. I'm not talking to anybody. I am going to get these shipped. If I don't get them shipped, see now already somebody's texting me. Somebody wants something now. I don't have any of my markers. I just, I swear I don't know where my markers go. All right, print labels now. I'm not going to talk. There. Okay, I have got to, um, I've got to get some shipping done, David. I cannot talk. I told people I would not talk, and I'm already violating my rule until I'm done with shipping. You can't, it doesn't shoot anything, it just, it's a bang, it just makes its bang sound. Do you understand? Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, guys, I'm back. Um, well, this is day is going so well. Uh, let's see here. Well, I again, I thank everybody for joining today's show. It's kind of today's kind of show is a little boring, a little boring. Not every show is going to be funny. I don't know if you're watching this to be funny or to be humored. Maybe you're just bored at home. Maybe you work at home and you want to listen to somebody that's not going to drive you crazy. <laughs> Oh my gosh. All right, I got that done, that done, that gun. Wrap that baby up. I like to give caps away free when you buy a gun. But not a lot of people are taking advantage. Now, what happened to the other ones? He came out here and took those. Unbelievable. I tell you, this kid. Oh, he took my caps. David, bring those caps back here right now. Bring them back. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe it, guys. He took, he took the last two packets of my caps. What should I do to him, huh, guys? Okay, David, you're being judged by my live audience. You're not supposed to take... Where's the other caps? Where are the two rolls? You gave me one. No, I know, but you didn't. You were supposed to take the other one. Now I don't have another one. Outside, guys. Where's the other roll? There are three rolls here, David. Where's the other roll? No, I, okay, not in here. Oh my gosh. I don't believe it. He took... Okay, so the caps I gave him, he took the rest outside. He just came and took them. Does that make any sense? No, it doesn't. That, that's my life, guys. That is my life in a nutshell. I'm going crazy, crazy, crazy for loving you, I'm crazy, crazy, that's Patsy Klein. here, come here, Boy, let me see that, bring it here. Where's the roll? Now, can I ask you a question? Yes. Why did you come and grab those without telling me? I told you, but you didn't answer. I did, okay, so what should you have done? Should you have gone ahead and taken them, or should you have waited? 
Right, why didn't you? Smack me in the face. No, I'm not going to smack you in the face. Go get your... Uh, uh, you're supposed to have a coat on. It's too warm for a coat. No, it's not. It's cold outside. Okay, guys. All right, so I'm almost done here. Rush Limbaugh is going to be starting here in about 15. He, was, he wasn't supposed to be on like yesterday. Um... I um I think I hope things go well with him. I'm just worried. I'm worried. My son is complaining from his remote location. Jessica, let's see, Jessica, I don't have that. What am I going to do, Jessica? I make my own boxes. I bought this single uh, layer corrugated, a roll of it, and I make my own boxes. Boxes are very expensive, and if I can save, every little bit helps. Because it really doesn't the box doesn't, it, just so people know, when an item is shipped to you, it's barely, it's, it's, it's not touched that much. It, once it goes on the conveyor, it basically is just kind of riding on a conveyor. It's not being touched. It's not being, it's not being, it's not being dropped uh, to poor say. Now it does get dropped once, once, but very few, very off, very, very little. Because the computer conveyors, you know, because of the scanning and all that, it's being scanned, and uh, um, it's hardly ever touched. And therefore, you know, a box is really, if you look at your boxes from Amazon, just, just for an example, just look at your boxes and ch over the next couple weeks. Look at how much damage there is on the box. Just the box. Just look at the box, and I'm not saying every one of them, but look at most of them. I've got them right here. I reship them. Four, six. Look at the box from Amazon. You'll know exactly what I'm talking about. Exactly. Okay, guys, 
All right, this is Brian Young with ProTinkerToys.com, ProTinkerToys.com. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe us. Give us thumbs up. We hit our milestones, so now we are being monetized, which will help us in uh, broadcasting new. Open the door, please. I like the sun coming in. Thank you. I'm going to sign off now. I got most of my shipping done. I just have to do a couple big boxes. Uh, see you tomorrow for the live broadcast. Tomorrow will be the live broadcast of the Snake and Mongoose sets, which will be coming from Toledo, Estes Freight. Uh, they'll be coming out here. Uh, matter of fact, I'll do a quick... Uh, I'll just, I'm going to do this thing quick here, see if I can do this without getting it all messed up. Can you just hold on a second? I'm going to unhook the camera for a minute. From our little base here. Okay, I gotta undo it here. And I'm gonna show you where we're gonna be doing it. So this is outside the workshop. We're gonna have the camera over here. The trucks, the truck will probably pull up right here. That's my camper that I've been using. And we're gonna unload all the sets right there. David, don't do that. So we're gonna show it live broadcast. Uh, as we are bringing it into uh, ProTiggerToys.com, the inside of the shop here. Okay, so I want everybody to know what's going to happen tomorrow. And uh, have a nice day. Enjoy your lunch. Hasta belista, baby. Yeah.